Health Secretary Wes Streeting and Chancellor Rachel Reeves said this week's cash announcements would begin to arrest the decline in the health service. The NHS will face real problems this winter, despite receiving billions of pounds in the budget, the health secretary has warned. Planned investment for the NHS will include £1.5 billion for surgical hubs and scanners and £70 million for radiotherapy machines. But during a visit to St George's Hospital in London on Monday, Chancellor Rachel Reeves and Wes Streeting stressed that the cash would only help to arrest the decline in the health service's performance. Mr Streeting suggested the NHS was somewhat better off heading into winter this year after the pay dispute with junior doctors was resolved. But he said, I can't promise that there won't be people waiting on trolleys in corridors this winter. There are people in that position already today. What this budget will enable us to do is arrest the decline in the NHS and start fixing the foundation so we can not only get the NHS back on its feet but make sure it's fit for the future. There will still be real problems this winter but we're not going to deny the scale of the problems and we're already supporting system leaders to try and minimize the risk. Ms Reeve said she had spoken to staff who were still using equipment purchased under the last Labour government that should have been replaced. She said her plan would increase the NHS capital budget to the highest level since 2010. But the Chancellor added, I don't think in one budget you can undo 14 years of damage.